round of the back-to-back -back, uh, double headers we have for you here today. We've seen out one game. This premises to be another exciting one. The weather, not much difference from the first uh, game we have here. It was 41 degrees centigrade. It is 40 degrees uh, centigrade now. So that's very, very scorching hot. And uh, it's uh, synthetic tough. So you will expect that the two sides will have all to do for it to be able to keep their cool. But this is a game between Kano Pillars and FC Taraba, who have been promoted to the Premier League uh, just uh, this season. So you expect to see great things. But FC Taraba are uh, the one of the back-to-back -back, uh, double headers we have for you here today. We've seen out one game. This premises to be another exciting one. The weather, not much difference from the first uh, game we have here. It was 41 degrees centigrade. It is 40 degrees uh, centigrade now. So that's very, very scorching hot. And uh, it's uh, synthetic tough. So you will expect that the two sides will have all to do for it to be able to keep their cool. But this is a game between Kano Pillars and FC Taraba, who have been promoted to the Premier League uh, just uh, this season. So you expect to see great things. But FC Taraba are uh, the big table and uh, the standings. Theo Pillars of Heroka is a very familiar face. Uh, he's an, a permanent fixture between the sticks for Kano Pillars, skipper of the side, visionary, and uh, very influential. But Kano Pillars, look at that team sheet. Teofilos Afelokai, Isaac Hele, uh, Nazif Yamani, Omar Zangu, Kingsley Udo, Enejo Tekpa, Aziz Shobowale, Zika Ramba, Gambo Mohamed, Rabiu Ali, and Muni Rubale. It doesn't come any stronger than that. That's probably the best lineup you can find in any club side in Nigeria going into a game. So, uh, did I hear you say uh, you feel some uh, trepidation on behalf of FC Taraba? Well, take a look at FC Taraba. They've got some great names as, as well themselves. Some of them not very well-known names, but uh, you might be surprised. They've done so well so far. Olushola, Hashimu, Bobby, Dojikwes, uh, former coach of the year, African coach of the year. And uh, he let Enyimba, don't forget, to win the Champions League. And of course, uh, Nduka Nduguisi. Nduka Nduguisi used to be the coach of Heartland of Oweri. So there are two men who know each other very well. Because Oke okay, Modi was in charge of Enyimba, next door neighbors to Heartland, where Nduka Nduguisi was calling the shot. So besides the play on the field, we also expect a lot to happen from the technical benches from the two sides. That's what is confronting us today. That's the game we are all here for. That's the game the cameras are here to capture. That's the game that the teaming fans here are out to enjoy to the hilt. The stadium uh, is beginning to look like it couldn't take any more. Uh, but people are still streaming in and trooping in. Uh, well, what can you say about them? They've been uh, very, very strong at home, winning their three home games against the likes of Natarawa United, El Karimi Warriors, and surprisingly, in Yimba, away from home, they've come on stock, uh, losing... Uh, who have campaigned in the CAF Champions League a number of times. Taraba FC just coming into the big time for the first time, and then they are the first to come forward. And a shot there! I thought it was going to be a shot! By Captain Okai, a couple of minutes earlier, on Chai, the former Kaduna United shot stopper, was... Uh, up to the task. Well, the skipper of the side picking up a yellow of the seriousness it deserves. FC Taraba and a good race for the ball. Oh, good touch there and the free kick won. That was a uh, masterful, masterful dummy there sold by Aliru Hashimu. Otekwa Energy, formerly of Lobby Stars and Enyimba of Aba. A veteran in the league. Some nuisance value, at least as far as the uh, pillars are concerned. But that's an injury scare. But, uh, well, no dull moment at all since the kickoff of this game, Kenichi. Not at all. It's, it's been a very, very good.
good game of football so far. The only thing we've not seen here are goals. There have been penalty appeals, a dive in the box. And that gave Pillars the chance to recover. Well, uh, uh, characteristically, that a huge hole appeared in the center of the Pillars defense. That was some, like a diacetical approach. He should have struck here. He should have struck there. He didn't strike. And eventually, the experienced King Sludo came sliding across, you know, to put that ball into touch for a corner kick. But Bob Yebos. But then, to be can to be seen, to can to be seen, things is to be commended. Well, maybe a, a tad too early for commendations to be given out again. Canopilla's defense found wanting. That was a wayward backward header from. Uh, and that ball is given away is Bobby now. Bobby Abel, he needs help. He gets into the form of his keeper. But let's share the game. That's what we have in common here. <laughs> it's uh, an enthralling game, isn't it? <laughs> and coming forward again now. And uh, it's uh, FC Tarava. Bobby Abel. Bobby Abel, does he have some help now? Yeah. Devils seem to be unchained now. <laughs> They've really turned on the style. The champions. 2-0, they won against Wolves uh, last week, and 2-0, they lead here today. They oh. It's a free kick, and uh, I think we're seeing a yellow card. The first yellow card for Kano Peelers. Indeed. Uh, so Tekpa, who goes into the referee's book? Uh, for that cynical foul. Times players do all this. that was not necessary inside the half of FC Taraba into the back of Bobby oh, Ebel, who go. couldn't have done any damage from that distance. But that's the first booking of the afternoon for Kano Pillars. Again, Bobby Ebel causing all sorts of problems. Killers, they want to respond immediately. Again, it is Bobby Abel. Bobby Abel, perhaps he was going to flash a shot there. He's waited too long. And uh, the yellow shot. The man in red. Bobby, Bobby, Bobby! We see Nduka.
manos. Bobby Lepin, he now has three goals in the tournament, the tournament for this tournament.